Hi, my name is Elizabeth Crispalusi. I publish a blog called Tech for Luddites, providing tips and tricks for navigating our digital world. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add password protections to a PDF file that you upload into WordPress. There are two different ways you could add password protection to make sure that your PDF files are not being seen by people you don't want to see them. The first one is to actually put the password protection in the PDF file. The second one is to put it into the WordPress blog post or page. I'm going to show you both starting with the PDF file. So I've already set up uh, a PDF that is unprotected called Sample PDF. And it's really simple. When you've got it open, in, you do need uh, Adobe Acrobat Pro. You can't do this with the free Adobe Reader. You must have the, Acrobat Pro, or the, the paid Acrobat software. Uh, and if you've got that, then you just have to uh, click Secure and Encrypt with Password. And it's going to ask you if you really want to do this. And you say yes. And so you're going to go down and you're going to say require a password to open the document. So just for, well, I'm just using password so I don't forget it between now and uploading it. Um, now you also have the option in Acrobat to not just uh, require a password to open the document, you can also require a password to make, uh, to edit it or to print it. I'm not going to set that now, but just so you notice that that option is available. So I'm going to say okay. And then I need to reconfirm it. This is kind of the same thing like when you're asked to reconfirm your email address to make sure that you did remember it correctly. So I'm going to say OK. Now I actually have to save the file again. So I'm going to go Control S to save it. It gives me another warning. Now when I close it and I try to open it again, it's now going to say it needs a password before I can open it. And there you go. So that's how you do it if you actually want to do it to the PDF file. Now I'm going to show you how to do it if you want to do it within WordPress. Um, and so what you want to do is there, you want to actually password protect the blog post or the, or, or the, uh, the web page that you're inserting the PDF into. So we'll just create a new post in the dashboard. And I will show you, you, we can just add the media. I actually have this uploaded so I can take it straight from the uh, media library. Insert it into post. Now what I want to do is I actually want to make the visibility, it's still public, but I want to, I mean I want to change it from public to password protected. And it asks me again for the password. This time it doesn't hide it, so you can see what it is. Now when I publish this, um, I'm going to view the post. Now, because I'm in the same browser that I'm logged in, uh, it actually shows it pre-populated with the password. So I'm just going to copy this URL. And I'm going to go post it in uh, a different browser, so you can see if I wasn't already logged in how that would work. There you go. Protected. Again, just enter the password, submit, and now I can download the PDF file. Okay, so now you know two different ways to password protect a PDF document that you're downloading from WordPress. 